am Alfred. Um, welcome back to Dishonored. Go ahead. I don't know what to say. I guess I'm just happy they're listening. <laughs> Hi, guys. <laughs> um, I played around with the microphone because normally I don't have my microphone as loud as it can be, but I actually upped it to the maximum because we're both just having troubles trying to fucking hear it. I'm also not the best at projecting my voice. So but... it has to be nearer to her. And then also I can't have it be too loud because I'll blow it out. So, <laughs> so you know. Hey, by the way, if this little light turns red, it means you're blowing out the microphone. Oh, goodness. Okay. Well, I guess I'm not used to being able to just talk my normal, uh, you know, voice, so. Ooh, I'm excited. People can actually hear me now. <clears throat> I mean, the problem was actually hearing me because it had to be much closer to you. Mm-hmm. Ten money. Um, but hopefully this should be a little better. So, remember where we were? Um, we just got done with doing... A mission. Yeah. Got some runes. Slotted them in. I don't remember what our next thing was. Did we start our next thing? Uh, no, we're in the process of starting. Yeah, the only other thing I remember is the gay poetry. <laughs> I really want to find, like, if there's, like, a second half of that. Is that so? Yeah, that'd be great. I'm more engrossed in their story than I than I am with this one. Even though I do like this one. <laughs> You're lucky I found them before the Admiral did. It is every citizen. It's a nice old pub. These beds have seen passion. quite a bit each. Gross. The state depends on you. Uh. These beds have been used more times than me. What do you mean, Lydia? Be on the lookout for the young Prince of Tivia, too. It doesn't say one there, which is kind of unfortunate, because to me that says that that's all that there is. I actually really like the look of those baths. That's one thing I uh, I really wish we had, was just really deep baths. Like big wooden baths? Look, it's got a little seat in there. Ooh! Maybe a little bath boy. Like, I, I don't, I don't, I don't mind that. Maid who started it. She took ill one morning after her chores but the milk had already been delivered. That was all it took for them to wall the place off. Plague spreads fast. Fucking typhoid Mary. <laughs> That's why you really shouldn't share your breast milk that wide. Make it more personal, you know? Share with a friend. Yeah. What's up, bitch? Hello, Corvo. I expect Martin will be joining us shortly. I hate to start your day with such a strange matter, but... But do you have any breast milk? Heard something last night, moving through the storm drains beneath the building. Most likely a weeper, the poor bastard. There's no hope for them once the plague gets that far along. So we're gonna meet a Nothing weeper. more than a shuffling corpse full of Ooh. sickness and insects, if you ask me. I'd appreciate you investigating, just to be sure it's not a nosy guardsman that's getting too close. Here's a key to the hatches. I tend to servant down there, but they die of fear on the spot, I'm afraid. Maybe Piero can concoct some sort of sleep poison for your crossbow if you want to go that route. So yeah, due to plot, you uh, cannot catch the plague at any point. Wait, why can't you? The actual reason is that I have the mask on, but right now I actually don't have it on. Yeah, I mean, that would be a great uh, gameplay mechanic, you know, caught the plague. <laughs> <laughs> Big all caps, fucking Dark Souls, exclamation point, caught the, caught the plague, plague, exclamation point. No weep is over here, boys. You know, that's one thing. Ah, uh... oh, the fucking piranha! <laughs> oh my god, get out, get out, get out. I'm trying. <laughs> um, I know that they probably didn't get it from Spanish, but what, uh, I think that's, I, what I'm trying to say is that one thing I wish English had was a... Uh, you know, a, starting a sentence with starting a, a sentence with punctuation, so I know what's gonna happen. <laughs> English leaves me on edge. I don't know where this sentence is gonna end. Yeah, is this gonna be a question? You'll never know. And am I gonna have, to the very am end. I gonna have to raise my voice at the end? <laughs> All right. That's why I have such a problem of like uh, reading on the spot too. 
Cause like it will end in a question and I'll be like, you know, oh, really threw me. This is a nice little pub. Yeah, but there's a lot of broken <laughs> glass everywhere. It really kind of ruins the experience, you know? I think it uh, heightens it. Yeah, then again, you do live in Missouri. I don't know if you know, but there's a bylaw where you have to throw all your fucking broken glass into the street. So, what do you think? We've got plague victims here. How should I deal with them? Uh, are they after you? They don't really... Or are they kind of just, like, asking for help? It's unclear. They're Can probably you... asking for help. Oh, I, I feel bad for them. Leave them. Just walk by them. Goodness. Sorry. <gasps> That's probably the best. I'm putting them out of their misery. Oh. See, so, so yeah, you can see that they, they're called weepers because they just leak blood from the eyes and nose. Um. At that point, I would just off myself. Jesus. Well, at this point, they actually don't have the faculties to do so, otherwise. Oh, are you work. serious? Yeah. Ooh. The plague's really bad. Vaccinate your kids, everyone. Yeah. Sorry, I won't be here for the next meeting or ever again, for that matter. What happened here was unnatural, makes me sick to recall. I left the results of our labors here for you to keep, but I expect the rats will consume it before I return. I think the heart's trying to tell you something. What is it, girl? <laughs> so the thing that they're referring to uh, is... Man. Someone in the basement's below. How kills how. And money changes hands. So the reason that this is called the Hound Pits is because, uh, they, um, they have, uh, dog fights in the basement. Oh. For Christ's sake. Oh no, sake. oh no. What happened? Admiral Havelock. Hey, good job. This person tried to start talking to me. Dust here, dust there. While I was trying to climb up. The whole world is, dust is she a, is she like a... Newsboy? Well, no, is she like Newsboy? a main character? Because she's really pretty. Yeah. Next cosplay. Blood from the eyes is what that says. And it does refer to the weepers. I totally forgot about this, like, weeper side mission. Because what we're actually meant to be doing is starting the next, like, mission mission, which is the Golden Cat, I believe. Do you think they, uh, you know, fiddled with the names and, like, you know, that seeper? Ew. <laughs> Leaker. Juicer. Ooh. You said leaker. Don't look at me. That was really icky. <laughs> Fucking piranhas! It's like Skyrim all over again. It is. What is it with fucking Bethesda games? Get me out of the fucking water. Nothing will make me fear the water as much as Resident Evil 4 did. Yeah. You never know when a big mouth bass is gonna shove up and try to suck your dick. <laughs> get some things done with that you bass. Get a lot of stuff done <laughs> with a big mouth. Okay. Powers. Um, Agility. So, my sprint is now much quicker, and I have an air hike. All right. I have a fucking Devil May Cry double I jump. I know the Golden Cat, not as a patron. I designed some specialized devices for Captain Blue. Please. I promise you, I was Anyone not is curious? fraternizing with I the maidens. I worked no. there, you see. Holly, I won't make that mistake maidens are not what... I'm sorry. Fantasy I, uh, prostitutes oh, are called, I guess. Corvo, my friend. Do you need ammunition? Pretty antithetical, weaponry? I would say. Would you like me to craft something? Can it, you? goggles. Don't bully him. 
He's helping you. Yeah, right. Um. Ah, oh, fuck. What should I get? Help me out here. Mm. I can make my crossbow longer. Uh, I would say go down. And then, uh, do you ever use the spring razor? I love them. Yeah, get that. Okay. All right. Ah, hello, Corvo. Hello, Corvo. They're important things we have to stop. What's up? Corvo, I trust you remember Martin, an overseer before and perhaps again someday soon. That was I the guy we freed from the stocks. For my rescue. Mm. Indeed, you've given us a glimmer of hope, Corvo. Because we've gotten what we wanted from Campbell's journey. You've done it. We know where Emily called. You just help. touched your beard in, in sympathy. Emp an empathy a beard touch. For aristocrats. Little better than a cursed brothel. But there's an unfortunate twist. It appears that Pendleton's own kinsmen stand in our way. The twins, Morgan and Custis. Custis. Not only are they controlling <laughs> Emily. They have the controlling parliamentary votes we so desperately need. So because they're rich, they yes, uh, got a lot of votes in parliament. But most importantly, Emily must be brought And what's more, they're holding Emily. Until the Lord Regent and his entourage have been dealt with. Pendleton's right. waiting for you on the dock. He's asked to brief you personally. I think it's best. So as you recall, there's, um... There's three brothers, triplets... This guy is one of them, and the other two are twins. They're kind of cunts. So, two, just the man I needed to speak with. Like identical twins and one fraternal. Wait, no, that's not the word. That it, that that's also not how that works. I, I I'm confused about what you're trying to say. There's three triplets. Mm -hmm. Two of them ended up cuts due, like cunts due to mimetic stuff, nurture, not nature. Mm -hmm. This one's kind of oh, nice. Oh, okay. Corvo, I've asked to speak to you myself. You see, I'm sending you to kill my older brothers, Morgan and Custis. They're horrible men. So he's like, it's yeah, true, they're my brothers, cool they're assholes, but... Brothers. Further, my brothers are close allies to the Lord Regent. So they're best friends with the final boss. In Parliament, we cannot gather the votes we'll need to stop the Lord Regent from further consolidating his power. These days, they're best known for exploiting their favor with them to cheat others out of their wealth. Let's just say that not every family evicted in quarantine for having the plague actually has the plague. So they're being cons. I warned my brothers in every way I could. I really did. But they never did listen to me. They'll be at the Golden Cat tonight at their usual revels. They'll be protected by the city watch. So it'll be dangerous. Not like the other mission, now which go. was a walk in the park. Please do it before I change my mind. He just does that for emphasis. It's filled with, like, grape juice. There's only Diet Coke in that thing. How is he getting drunk? I'll take you to the Golden Cat when you're ready. He wants to fit in with I've everyone else. <laughs> Look, it's a pub, and this is the water. Like, you can see the fucking quality of the water right here. That's about as good as it gets, so it's... That's a cool mask. Oh, it's the best. Robert has one. It was a pre-order bonus for Dishonored 2. It's a copy of Corvo's mask. Cat, Corvo. I'm have to borrow that. You know, I have to go it. the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holger Square. The main thing is to make sure... Holger Square is interesting. Holger is the dude who, um... Safe and sure. Fucking, what's his name? He, uh, is the artificer. He was the artificer for the Abbey. Hmm. I love, a uh, boat talks, you know? Like in God of War, uh, 4. Boats, yeah, boat stories. Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall whiskey factory. They sell the elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. I'll lay low, but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you bring him back Good luck I hope you. nothing bad happens to I this know man. Emily must mean a lot to you. I don't mind him. Yeah, he's great. So, loyalists believe that Emily is at the Golden Cat. Um, older brothers. Oh, they're twins. Fuck. So they're twins and he's their younger brother. Fucking whatever. Never mind. I was, I was wrong. So these are Custis and Morgan. Mm. This is going to bother me, but what was that word I was looking for? 
Going up the street corner. When they're born at the same time, but they don't look alike. Not identical twins. There, there's a, there's a word for it. Hold on. Fraternal twins. Yes. Yeah, I think that's what I said. Oh, check it. So this is because I've been such a fucking ranted cunt in the last couple of missions, and I just killed wantonly. There's a sentry gun up there. Oh my goodness. Shooting at the uh, the weepers and. Uh, all the um, all the plague rats I summoned, uh, really did not help the uh, plague thing in the city. Hey, this guy was gonna go take a pee. Sorry. No pee for you, Mister. Uh, because the. Wait, wait. Throw him in the throw him in the water. No, that'll kill him. Are we trying to be good this time? I'm trying to be good to a point. I'm just but really I to show curious. You this. They started to put on masks because the plague has gotten so bad. Man, I wish we would do that. We as in, like, a society, not... You know, I've heard we do live in a society. <laughs> what I'm saying is that Americans are cunts. Yes. Yes, that's what, that, that, that is what I was saying. Thank you, Con. Uh, yeah. People know that's my middle name. You can say it. Ugh. Oh, hello, sir. <laughs> One. Snuck up on you. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Watch out. Let me just... Remember that scene from Megamind where, uh, Metro Man, like, has a whole... just, like, baby's day out? With his time freezing. Yeah. Okay, you have to admit that that was really baller. <laughs> oh, here we go. Well, I actually don't need to rewire it now that I've just disabled it. But I stopped time. That didn't explode. Wow. Oh, there it goes. I stopped time, killed two guys, teleported up here, and ripped the tank out. These explosive mechanisms are really bouncy. Ooh, crunch. That was the. That was the uh, indication of not taking fall damage. So yeah, you can see that there's a lot more weepers. Um, in my first playthrough, this state of chaos didn't happen until like another mission or two from now. This is Mercy. How bad can it get? That's about as bad as it can get before you die. No, 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 no. I mean, like, you're the state of chaos. The the city? Um, yes. Rats blanket every inch of the street. Um, there's more weepers than anyone else. Uh, and the only things that have their faculties about them are the assault towers, which are automatic, and tall boys. And then Bloodborne began. Yeah, basically. Uh, Thaddeus Campbell, branded formerly High Overseer, is no longer a citizen. It is a criminal offense to offer this man aid or housing. Contact the City Watch if you need any information. If you have any information, a reward is available. Jesus, that's pretty rough. Yeah, but I didn't kill him. Fair enough. So that that's the thing, right? You can go through this game without killing anyone if you want. And I don't know if I've done that, but I might do that. Mm. Um, the way to get the good ending is basically only kill if it's absolutely necessary and only kill your main targets. But if you want to go completely non-lethal, it is possible, and the way to do it is by doing the things that I did. So you brand the Overseer and excommunicate him. So have you ever gotten the good ending? Uh, yes, I, I have gotten the good ending. Oh, okay. With a low kill playthrough, but not a no kill. Um, but yeah, one of the things is that the not killing options are sometimes worse than the kills. Hey, sometimes people just gotta go. Yeah. So, Dowd. Look at this fucking guy. For the murders of various individuals of note and crimes of heresy, Dowd, enemy of the city, 5,000 monies, offenses of this man are high crimes and restrictions of the high overseer, and his applause, and the edicts of a brave lord regent. We don't care about those, all those other people not of note. So, warning, don't lose your head. Outlying districts are cautioned against a stalker in the night, has beheaded a score of citizens, obey curfew and observe curfew, uh, obey all instructions of the city watch. Report any suspicious person. Is that you? That's me. Be because I've just dismembered so many people. Because I'm, I'm fighting very, very violently and bloodily. 
and and the game is reflecting that. Well, I mean, everybody who who you've you've uh, you know taken their head, they fought you. Hey, yeah. You're just a man I's looking for. I would understand, like, if you start killing innocent people. Oh, I, I, I've I probably killed a few innocent people just oh, by summoning too many rats. Ew. Nope. That him? Yeah, he's the one. Hey, we got a message for you. The rat Slacker. man. He wants to talk at the distillery. I'll be right with you, sirs. Yep. Oh, there we go. Gone. Like a shadow. Yep. I'm pretty cool, huh? Got anything to smoke or eat? Blow and he starts off, humming his little, his little sneaky little song like Crunk. Oh fuck! Are you serious? Who is that? That's a whaler. There's. Oh. So these dudes are Dowd's boys. These are the guys who killed. This is bad. So they can go, right? So these are the guys who killed the queen. Yes. They're um they're about as extreme as it gets. You they can see that they fight just like me. They have the same kind of sword, they use crossbows, they have the same kind of mask, and the really scary ones have access to outsider's magic. Ooh. Doubt is uh the most skilled with it, possibly the most skilled besides Corvo. Um which is why you play as Doubt in the DLC. So do those come about because of the chaos? Yes. That's just a normal guard. Regular guard and regular guard. What is he doing? Oh yeah, so you can see that there's now higher ranks of guards. This dude is investigating that crime scene Ooh, that I left behind, okay. remember? Uh -huh. This is the doctor's office. Mm -hmm. So you can see that there's higher ranks of guards and there's way more guards here. There's like seven in this fucking area. And yeah, that's, that's because I just made such a fucking dog's dinner of this fucking city. Oh, come on. Who? Ah! Yep, there he is. Ah, ah. So, that teleport thing that he did, that's what it looks like when I teleport. Me spook. Yeah, Jesus. These guys, these guys are real fucking problems. types of goodies. Who? You. No, 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 no. There was a sting. There was a, there was a noise. Yeah. Oh, is it you? Oh, wow. There's a lot of you. Uh, Bottle Street Boys. The Bottle Street Gang is a, um... I think they're who... Hooligans? Oh. You've been played! Oh. All right. Bone Charms, Bone Charms. The actual reason that you can throw bottles like that, by the way, is so you can distract people by making a loud noise. Mm -hmm. I just love breaking glass, though. Uh, let's see if there's anything. Nope. So yeah, um, I've got to be honest. I don't know if I've ever gotten the city so fucking bad that whalers start showing up in here. The fuck are you Shut up. That's a that's really extreme. I see we're going for that extra evil playthrough. Yeah. That the thing is we we declared that like we were going to How long have I been recording? We've been going for 20 minutes. 24. Um I don't think they're going to last much longer. That's what they get for taking free swigs from the still. That tainted elixir is bad stuff. Oh yeah, right. These guys want to talk what to me, but I'm the one who uh I think. Elixir is supposed to prevent the plague sick. Fight it all. Well, you know it's bad but when you walk up to someone still, in their and now we got talk the elixir prompt that gives says you the plague. thug. Would you hear what he's saying? Slackjaw thinking someone poisoned the still to ruin <laughs> the elixir. He's talking about what I did. Hey, they think someone poisoned him. Kooky. Oh. Well, 
Hold on, let me get my whip my weapons ready. Flank job be wait. Oh Jesus. Hmm. I wonder if I can. No. Oh, why not? Uh, you need a higher level to control more um, certain types of being. Mm. You can upgrade most of your shit. I just imagine that Corvo is like eating all of those objects you pick up, stuffing them in his cheeks. <laughs> oh, all glass, they're like crunchy. To unleash them later. <laughs> Spits out glass like watermelon seeds. <laughs> God, that can't be bad. That can't be good for your lips, right? <laughs> Like, I know that that's probably an odd thing to say. But... They're English. Their lips are crusty anyway. Yeah, and their teeth are bad. Though remember that Corvo is uh, not a fantasy Englishman. Oh, right. Is he Tivian? I didn't look up what is, like, where, what fucking island he's from. His lips are smooth. Yeah, do you see that wanted poster? Wow. What's up, Slack? He is a villain if I judge your looks are right. A villain I might have some work for. Somebody put plague in the brute tank. Half my men are weepers. Trapped three of them in the distillery. Rest are wandering in the street. I love this mustache Since so much. Right. I find myself short of able bodies. I may have a point of interest for you, see? I want to know this man. He Where looks so I bisexual. Figured, there ain't nobody yeah. worth killing around here except those two Pendletons over at the Golden Cat. I'm right, ain't I? See. So he's so on the level. I, you know. Them boys are twins. Rich me. I feel bad me. about poisoning you and everyone you know, buddy. They've been laying low there. Sorry, I had to do it for Granny Rags. There's a lot of security at the Golden Cap tonight, though. Special guests and the like. But you're gonna walk in there dressed like that and kill the Pendleton brothers? Maybe I got a better way to. Maybe he's got a too. better way. If you're doing something for me first, understand. Oh, you got it, buddy. Someone, I don't know who, is killing my men, taking my territory, stealing my goods. Might be a fellow name of Galvani. Galvani. I sent my best man <gasps> to investigate, but he didn't <laughs> Well, now I need... So you can see how out. this story interacts with itself. Go to this Galvani's place. He lives nearby off Clavering Boulevard. I do not know where you Galvani lives. I'll get your better way into the Golden Cat. Look at those pants. Yeah, right? He's stuffed in those things. So, no one talks about this, but the Bottle Street dudes are able to drink from their, like, whiskey bottles and That's spew the fire out of their mouth. Like Holy this. shit. I, uh, you can see it in a few of the earlier episodes. The still is infected. So yeah, that shit'll poison you. Which is... My fault entirely. You know, eye for an eye. And by that I mean I'll, I'll hurt these people and then I'll do a side quest for them to help them. I'm gonna take your eye and then, like, two weeks later, uh, hey, I found this for you. Holy friend. shit. Oh shit. Mercy killing. Mercy killing. I think. Hey, I can't... sorry about your death. I... Oh, too soon? Oh, boy. Shoots. Yeah, explosive bottle, see? Hey, you can get that rune now. I can. I don't know why this door got open. Spirited. Potions give you more shit. That's fine. You guys just let those dudes out? Oh, so there's a lot of them. I have uh, some auto-aim on. I mean, it's on by default, and I didn't turn it off. Um, I can't remember if you get shit deducted for killing weepers. It counts as a kill, but I'm not sure if it raises the chaos. Because, like, you're not going to make more plague by killing a weeper. But you are going to make more plague by you looking at? killing someone else. This is gonna hurt. <laughs> Rats. You live on through me. My brothers. Ooh, that's a lot of rat flesh. That's a lot. I ate some rats. You stuff them into your cheeks. Yep. 
Jeez, Corvo, how do you have so much room for rats in that mask? Get a lot of things done with a big mouth. It's true. <laughs> fuck, fuck. Oh. Platforming. Ooh, I really like that tile sound. The, the what? The, the sound of your feet against the tile. Yeah. Reminds me of uh, Minecraft cobblestone. That's nice. Attention Dunwall citizens. Due to criminal activity near Holger Square, the area... Corvo is, is sweating under, under that mask. Watchtowers and support patrols have been deployed. Any suspicious person will be assumed hostile with... Nothing suspicious here. Just a ghost man teleporting everywhere. So yeah, the whalers are some of my favorite enemies in every game. Like any game, really. Cause like you know you know I love the enemy type that's just you. Um, I think that this was what's his face's storehouse. Oh wait, I Huh? Jesus. What a revolting development. Is there a bottle around here? You can find a rat. You're right. Oh, you could Wait, what if you try Probably and possess one of these guys? I wonder if I can yet. Nah. What is he saying there? I do not know. Because it sounds like, ah, oh, yes. It sounds like something not English, honestly. Rat tunnel, yeah. Secret tunnel. Secret Good. rat tunnel. Yeah. Through the city. Secret, Secret rat tunnel. tunnel. Yeah. Thank you, rat. Thank you for your service. Thank you for your service, rat. <laughs> Someone saw me in that second. <laughs> oh, right. Oh, all this shit's still broken. I mean, I guess who would replace it, right? Ohayas. So, uh... <laughs> Like, I went to go possess a rat with my rat powers. I went to go possess a rat, and uh, I, I accidentally almost hit the summon rat button. Oh, no. And I was like, oh god, I'm being attacked by rats. Quick, more rats. They'll <laughs> kill me. These rats will, will fight these rats. They'll kill me quicker and thus less painfully. Would you rather die slowly by a little rat, like a little bit of rats, or die fast by a lot of rats? I mean, killing a guy with one rat is literally a torture, you know? I guess so. No, have you heard of that? That's how they would uh, torture people in the Inquisition, I think. Oh, jeez, just one rat? Yeah, they would put one rat in a bowl, and then they would, um... Okay, so they would put a person on their stomach, right? Uh-huh. And then they would put um, a rat in a bowl. Oh, I don't like where this is going. Under their stomach, right? Oh, okay. And then they would uh, light a little fire underneath the bowl. So the rat would get its little feet burned. Oh. And so to escape it, it would chew through the person's stomach. Oh, and, and, out, and out the other side. He's getting his little peaties burned. Um, so yeah, that's how they would torture people in the Inquisition. Sir. Corvo's pretty a nice little, you know, home in his tummy for them to save them. Ugh. I don't think this is going where I want it to. <laughs> the conversation or the the the, t the rat tunnel. Oh, okay. This conversation's going exactly where I want it to. Oh. I love talking about rats and torture. 
For some reason, the, the use of the word fuck with, um, you know, 19th century English men, fantasy English men, is just, it seems odd. Yeah, like, what if Aragorn just said, fuck? That's where, where, where would I use my fuck in Lord of the Rings, I wonder? Mine is, mine is always Boromir. They have a fucking cave troll! <laughs> Just, if there's anyone in Lord of the Rings who should be allowed to say fuck and it isn't Gandalf, it should be Boromir. Absolutely. <laughs> like, the thing is, is that Gandalf would be too... He, he would use it too often, you know? It would lose its value. Borm, like, I think it would add to the character. I mean, it would add to Gandalf, but fuck would be weakened as a result. I think he's dead. You only right? get one. I know that. I mean, do we have suspects? 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 We ain't gonna waste time solving who killed him. Get over here. Dude! Okay, he's alive. We did it. Rune! Um, what should I get next? Um, what is Shadow Kid? Shadow kill is whenever you kill people, they melt into shadows. Is that, is there any reason for that except aesthetic or? Wait, did you get that book? Be, re be ready to pause. All right. Um, it means that people can't find the body and be like, hey, someone's running around here killing dudes. Well, I mean, you really haven't had that issue. Yeah, mostly because there's no one left alive to find them. <laughs> Ooh, fam. Is that the same? <gasps> I'm sorry, rats. It's okay, they go to rat heaven. They do. All rats go to heaven. Uh, I've seen that movie. Is that the same, like, little sing song from It? I don't know. Uh, the new It, by the way. I mean, probably not. Uh, return the autograph to Slackjaw. I wonder why it's called Slackjaw. I should know this. This is a game that I've played many times, and I did a f three or four episode series on just reading the lore of it. Well, but... he might. I mean, he might just have a Slackjaw. Yeah. Do you actually go all the way down when you open those? Yeah. See, it's just oh, very short. Oh, okay, okay. Just want to make sure. Um. Yeah, it's just, you know, bullies aren't very creative with their, uh... Uh, well, considering he's a gang boss, I assume that it's a name that he thought of himself. Oh, I guess I guess so. It's kind of like a or like an appropriate appellation. He's just he's just reclaiming his uh, you yeah, know, exactly his dis that. deformity. Yeah, exactly. Sorry, I'm like entranced by the the music here. I really like it. This game is a really good everything. Like, for one, this game has an art style. And, like, especially when this game came out, which is when Call of Duty ruled the fucking world, art style in games is usually not a thing. It doesn't want to be realistic, and it doesn't have to be, and that's great. Alright, be on your way, rats. I what's, love you. What's that art that's, like, um... It's realism, but... Slightly not? I do not know. Hmm. Oh, really? Right off the bat. Got you now. How far away are you to getting the um, possession where you can take hold of these guys? That was a stock sound effect. That's the sound effect from Half-Life when you hit something with a crowbar. Possession tier two is five runes. So Level I can one. control I can control uh, human targets with that. I can upgrade my blink with three runes. I can upgrade my bend time with eight. I can upgrade rats with four. I thought, I thought you said bedtime. Corvo can now go out past 11. <laughs> All right. Ooh, I, I like how it's picking up. Yeah. Hey, 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 wait a bit. What just occurred to me? How come it's always... Who do you think you'd run with in this town? What do you mean? Like, what faction would you side with? Oh, Granny Rags. I don't think she counts. 
Um. Because I can kind of see you running with these dudes in Bottle Street. Well, like, how many are there? Or how many have we been introduced to so far? Uh, we've met four. Um. I like the guy that was in here because he, like, had an awesome sense of style. Yeah, that's the Bottle Street. Is Galva Galvani, is he the one who wrote the, the gay play, or...? No. Oh, Slack not here. Huh? Sorry, I'm not paying attention to my own shit. Bunting. Art dealer Bunting is a man of taste. Everyone left him done well has anything left stealing. It's him. Whoever opened the snake gets double cut. Slack jaw. So, hey, if I find a safe and I open it, there's a lot of expensive shit in there. Yeah, there it's he saying, is. Slack jaw. Here you go. Oh, he's Slackjaw. Yeah. Information for my missing guy. Let's have a listen. I don't know why he's called Slackjaw. Okay. Is maybe that's a like that's a slang for uh, somebody who intakes. It's me, I'm okay, listen to this fucking audio back. log. He was right. There is someone once you dead. Wants to take over the distillery and the whole Bottle Street gang. And you'll never believe who it is neither. At first I did. That's why he's taking me so long. I wanted to be sure, and what's that? Fire! No! No! Ah! So Crowley's dead. Too bad. He was one of my best men. Ah! Uh, me they're getting me. Good, good line, Reed. Yeah. Take this key. It ain't for the gold card, no. no. This key's for the captain's chair. A hotel abandoned since the plague gutted this part of town. So I believe they actually Take do the, the side quest the in the speed run for Dishonor, just because it's so much quicker. Well. See that? Slackjaw keeps a bargain. But it might also There's just be because of that awesome audio log. Maybe a little better. Ah, uh, no! They're now killing they me! Again. I could get rid of the Pendletons for you. Tell my Quiet wife I love her. Hey, I like the shit out of that, my guy. You gotta do something for me in return. Interesting indeed. The cat's having a big reopening tonight. Lot of money. Clients, I'm really excited to see this. Uh, golden cat. Yeah. Bunting. They're hyping He's got it up. Particular taste. Particular so taste. By some of the ladies. Got some pretty fancy stuff locked away at his place. And the only thing preventing me from nabbing all that loot is the combination to a safe. Of course, the Pendletons have been camped out there for months, too. Not sure why. So that means a lot of the City Watch and other soldier types. Bring me that combination, my masked friend. And then I take care of the Pendleton brothers. Just like that. I like him. I like him a lot. I hope, oh, he's, yeah. not, I hope he's not a bad guy. Well, he's a gangster. I won't kill him. Well. And no one will ever see them again. So, but he's now giving me the deal. deal. He won't kill Slack the Pendletons. But they'll be gone. Get him out of here. Um, do you want me to spoil what happens to them? Or do you want to see it? Because I'm going to I'm gonna try and get it. I want to see it. Okay. And if you can't get it, then go ahead and tell me. Yeah. All right. Um, you know, that's actually probably good for an episode. Do you want to do the outro, too? Outro? Yeah. What does that mean? The outro. Sure. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. We're at the end of the episode. <laughs> so you do the outro, which is the opposite of an intro. Oh, okay. I'm new to this. <laughs> Sorry. You start. Hey, we're at the end of the episode. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Bye. I'm sorry. I had to be taught how to do an outro. Bye. Quiet. Get rat that makes all of the rules. Let's see what kind of troll we can get ourselves into.